We've been following this breaking news story since our newscast at 5 o'clock. Deputies in North Harris County say a homeowner shot and killed an intruder. This happened in the area of Rockcliffe Drive and Rainy River Drive. That is where Channel 2 Sophia Beausoleil is now live with the latest on this. Sophia. Detectives says the Harris County Sheriff's Office are still here collecting evidence, but we're told that the homeowner, a woman, is physically okay. She is shaken up after shooting that burglar who emptied her home. So here's what we know so far. The sheriff says that the shooting happened around 3 o'clock this afternoon. He says a woman in her 30s was home alone cleaning when she heard a noise. She thought it was a gunshot. She looked a little closer and spotted broken glass on the ground. The sheriff's office says she went to a different room, got a pistol because she was working for her safety and Sheriff Gonzalez says the woman hid inside a closet. Soon after, a male who was wearing a mask and gloves opened that closet door and the Harris County Sheriff's Office says the homeowner pulled the trigger and the one shot killed the suspect. Now, Sheriff Gonzalez says uh, his deputies along with medics responded. The young Hispanic suspect was pronounced dead inside the home. The sheriff says the woman had to do what she needed to do in order to protect herself. And kudos to her. I mean, you have a female alone inside her house. She could have panicked and not taken action, and she could have been truly a victim in more ways than one. Who knows what would have happened had he gained entry and, and put hands on her. And so she protected herself, and, you know, we're, we're glad that she's alive and that somebody that's breaking into somebody's home, uh, you know, again, you know, they, they, it's, it's very risky for them to do that. And obviously they have a family, and our condolences go out to family members. But, again, I mean, she had you know, a right to protect herself. And we did go up to the woman um, who shot the suspect. She obviously was very shaken up. She didn't want to speak to us. Totally understandable. But the sheriff says this is still very much an ongoing investigation and will go before a grand jury, which is the usual protocol in a situation like this. Reporting live from North Harris County, Sophia Beausoleil, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Sophia, thank you.